Hey guys, it's Mark from OnTheBandwagon.com and 42Freeway.com. I am in Wildwood, New Jersey at the very start, the southern end of the boardwalk. You can see it starting there. There's a convention center behind me. And of course, right here is the Wildwood Crest sign. Sorry to whip you around so fast. And obviously behind me is the large, beautiful, and expansive Wildwood Beach and the Wildwood Crest Beach. We are um, at the very first store here in Wildwood. A brand new restaurant eatery has opened up. So if there's anything that's synonymous with Wildwood Boardwalk in the food category, you know, if, you, if you follow the Wildwood groups, where's the best pizza? Cheese steaks is a close second, but where's the best pizza? And you have your Sam's fans, your Max Pizza, Alex's, Angelo's, Joe's. I see them all. I love them all. Um, well, we have a new pizza entry and it's a completely different twist on pizza. The very first store on the boardwalk on the southern end is now home to Kono Pizza. So Kono Pizza, it's the first, they're in the, they're in the United States, they're out of Italy, they're in the United States, but this is the first full brick and mortar store for Kono Pizza. The unique twist is the pizza is served in a cone, so it lives up to its name, Kono. Um, I've had it twice now, had it Saturday when they first opened just to check it out and I just tried it out now. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys uh, the video and, and one of the owners has given us, uh, Tim has given us a tour of, of what the pizza's all about and how it works. You know, and they're a lot more than pizza too. They have um, desserts they make with the cones. Um, they have, uh, uh, what did I have? The Nutella funnel fries, funnel cakes in French fry style. And then they added gelato, you know, they put gelato in there and, and you know, they said, it, obviously it's the beach, it's hot. It was a really beautiful weekend. Um, there's a bunch of competition for ice cream in the area. They didn't think they would do so great with it or just it would be a nice to have. They sold out in the first day. So um, they're waiting for the trucks to come in uh, tomorrow for the gelato. So okay, what we've got here is pizza in a cone. It's a cone made out of pizza dough. You stuff it with cheese sauce, then your topping. Cheese sauce topping three times up the cone. Okay, traditional pizza toppings. You got shrimp, you got crab meat, buffalo chicken's a good seller. You can mix up the two toppings. Anything after that, you kind of you can't really taste anything. Too many flavors. Pop it in the oven for three minutes. Comes out fresh. One cone's about two, two and a half slices of pizza. Very filling. Very good. We're the only brick and mortar in the United States. And where do the cones come from? The cones come from Italy, and so, ah. so do the ovens actually. Awesome. What All should right, I so get? Let's get, 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 get a, cone. Uh, I recommend the buffalo chicken. We made a blend of ranch and Frank's hot sauce that you, you get the heat but not too much. Uh, and I'm that in. is my favorite so far. I'm in, let's do it. Right. Buffalo is right here. Buffalo. Okay. Okay. Let's see what we get. Traditional cheese. Just throw a layer in there, give it a little tap. Coat your cone with some sauce. And we'll go with the Go oh, the pepperoni, that's pretty common. Stuff some pepperoni in there, get a little tap, some more cheese, some more sauce, another layer of pepperoni, and then we go cheese on the top layer. We like to pile it up pretty good, get a little pat down, a little dot of sauce in there, and top it off with a couple more pieces of pepperoni. Beautiful. Pop it in the oven. That'll be, out, that'll be out in three minutes. In the meantime, while you're waiting on your cone, take it down the line here. You got regular French fries, you got Parmesan fries, freshly grated Parmesan cheese and parsley. And then you got funnel cake fries. Same thing as a funnel cake, only shaped like a French fry. Put a little powdered sugar and some Nutella cream on it, awesome. Then we got dessert cones, same concept as the pizza cone. The, the, the cone comes out hot, the toppings inside are cold. The contrast is off the hook. We like the different kind of creations. We've got tiramisu that we can stuff in the cone. We've got cannoli cream, then we put some strawberries on there, and then this Nutella. We layer that three times, just like the pizza cone. Those suckers are good. Gelato, Italian ice cream. We sold out, we just opened about a week four, ago, four days, four days ago. ago. We days. sold out after two and a half days. Yeah. This stuff is awesome. And we got the granitas, that's the Italian slushy. This ain't Turkey Hill, you ain't getting these suckers anywhere else. Pina colada, cherry, blue raspberry, and we got others too. That's gonna sell out. Hey, don't today. take my word for it. What do you think, guy? Awesome. Oh, that's got a lot of flavor in it. Yeah, it's yeah, dead, yeah, on, yeah, dead yeah. on pina colada flavor. It's made with real fruit, not 
formulas or chemicals. There you go, my man. Let it cool for about a minute, then you eat it like a you eat it like an ice cream cone. Just put, nibble at it, turn it. Don't squeeze the cone. It looks really, really damn good. It is good. very good. And it is hot. All right, if this isn't the craziest damn thing, I'm getting ready to eat my delicious looking Konos cone. I had it sitting on the side um, and a fire broke out in the dunes right behind us here. So I want to eat this when it's hot. So what this is, is again, this is a, uh, get the lighting better. This, this cone is made in Italy and uh, they, they get them here in the facility, in the restaurant, and it's triple stacked. You guys saw the video. It looks really good, don't it, guy? <laughs> and they tell me you're supposed to eat it like an ice cream cone. I guess I should flip this around. All right, so again, we have, this is the pepperoni. That they were raving about the buffalo chicken. I went with the pepperoni. It's triple layer. It's cheese. Um, cheese, pepperoni, cheese, pepperoni, cheese, pepperoni on the top. Cooks it in a really cool oven. Um, oh, that's, that is really good. You can taste the quality of cheese. You know it's not? It's not greasy either. It's it's you know it's got the right amount of moisture in it, but it's definitely not greasy. People are cheering now because the fire has been put out. All right, so we're also trying these Nutella funnel fries. Look at this, a funnel cake shaped like a French fry. It's 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 ingenious. Why didn't we think of this before? Oh, these things are really good. Mm. How about you just guys just watch me look at this. Look at this. You know you want this. Mm. Too big of a bite on that one. And then we got the pizza cone. Mm -hmm. This is the pizza cone. Yeah. Cones are made in Italy. They're really good. Really good ingredients. Give it a shot. There's your guy right there. <laughs> oh, that's really good. All right. So I'm not a review guy. I, I want to treat myself at least the, the guy Fieri, you know, just positive things of interesting food items. Um, nothing to say here but positive. I really enjoyed this uh, pizza. You know, the cone, it looks unique when you see it. You're like, wait a minute. But when it cooks up, it's got the proper amount of crispiness. It's not thick. It's easy to chew through. Um, the, the ingredients inside, the cheese, the sauce, just really tasty. And you know, you would almost think that, you know, some of the pizzas on the boardwalk, you get susceptible of getting like a lot of grease. You know, you get at the bottom of your plate. Uh, and you would think that with a cone that maybe there would be some risk of that sort of clay. None. It was just, it's just perfectly cooked, perfectly put together, um, made for each user. You know, you pick the ingredients you want. They have some pre preset styles, but you pick your own ingredients. It's worth it. It's, it's really worth a try. And more than that, I think it's like, it's, it can almost become like a go-to place for me. It is the closest pizza shop on the boardwalk to me. We're, we're on the, the crest side here a couple blocks away. So this is the first hop on the boardwalk. Um, but I can see myself coming here you know, on a re regular basis. So uh, go try it out, the Kono Pizza. It's the Ocean Tower Shop building, and I'll show some cuts of the uh, building here um, right at the Wildwood Crest. Thanks, guys. On the bandwagon.com, 42freeway.com.